Hey everyone, so today we're going to do some Korean traditional archery. So this is the Kaya Windfighter. I recently bought it. It's a 35 pound Korean bow and we'll do some shooting with it. Now I'm very new to Korean archery so I'm not an expert by any means but this is just us having some fun and I'll show you my home setup. Now this isn't a tutorial video so please don't replicate anything that you see here unless you know what you're doing and you know that it's going to be safe and also make sure that you keep everyone else safe and that you obey all the laws and restrictions of your area. So this is my setup, we're in my garage, so it's a fully enclosed space, there's no way for any arrows to go over and miss the target and hit someone or hurt anyone, no way for anyone to come in or no doors for anyone to enter while I'm shooting. Now that's my target over there, you can't see it but behind it are two layers of fiberboard, then I've got two layers of EVA mats and then I've got my high density EVA target in the middle and around the target, in case I miss, then I've got towels which will help take out some of the kinetic energy from the arrows so that they don't go all the way through and damage the arrows by hitting the brick. So without further ado, let's do some shooting.
Alrighty, so as you can see, I'm not a particularly good shooter, but at the end of the day, it's all about having fun, isn't it? So, I hope you liked watching this video. I had a lot of fun. If you've got a chance to try out Korean traditional archery, I highly recommend you do. It's, it's a lot of fun. And so with that, I'll see you next time.